After struggling through the gnarliest terrain it's yet encountered, Perseverance drove across a transition in geologic history where the first sediments of Lake Jezero, or Jezero, were deposited. Then it passed them by, on this episode of Mars Guy. The primary objective of the Perseverance mission is to search for evidence of ancient microbial life in the Delta deposits, but the best hope for preservation of that evidence is in former layers of mud that dried out and turned to stone. Here's Mars Guy for scale. Mudstone on Earth is known to preserve traces of long-dead microbes for hundreds of millions to maybe billions of years, so Perseverance needs to find mudstones. Perseverance drove across a geologic transition, known as a contact, between the older volcanic rocks of the Sita terrain and younger rocks on top, laid down as sediments in ancient Lake Jezero. Most contacts on Mars are mapped using observations from satellites in orbit. A combination of morphology, the shapes and textures, and mineralogy obtained from infrared spectrometers is used to identify contacts. A rover provides the rare opportunity to ground truth orbital observations. Perseverance drove into Sita, encountering a landscape strewn with cobbles and boulders eroded from a formerly continuous expanse of volcanic bedrock. Its autonav self-driving system appears to have struggled to find a safe and passable route through this treacherous terrain, turning back on itself before giving up and phoning home. The next saw Perseverance drove directly toward a notably smooth and flat extension of the delta. From its next stop, Perseverance was rewarded with views of thin, flat layers of rock. These look like bottom set beds formed when this was a deep water location, with the finest sediments being deposited away from the more turbulent action closer to the main delta. Perseverance approached a promising outcrop of thinly bedded rocks with its potato hitchhiker still on board despite the gnarly terrain. It appeared set to begin a sampling operation, but after a few saws of observations without deploying its arm-mounted instruments, Perseverance moved on. It's possible that its spectrometers did not detect clay minerals, which are a key component of mudstones. It's also possible that the team is eyeing the feature known as the bacon strip for the first sampling of the delta deposits, something I described in episode 54. Perseverance has now changed course, driving toward the bacon strip. New views from the MassCam Z camera include a set of relatively light toned, flat lying rocks extending out from crumbling outcrops of thinly bedded rocks. This configuration may represent the preserved sequence of sediments first laid down on the floor of ancient Lake Jezero. Known as a stratigraphic sequence, such a configuration of rocks is prized by geologists trying to reconstruct events from the geologic past. Samples returned to Earth from this stratigraphic sequence might also hold details of great interest to astrobiologists.